Yes. Cat. Como estas? Bien, y tú? Bien, muy bien. I'm really proud right there. I know. Yeah. You yeah. understood and then responded in mm -hmm. Espanol. In Espanol. Which yeah. Which she always swore that a foreign language would come in handy someday. <laughs> and little did you know, it was in this video. I've been waiting, actually. I've been yeah. marking the days. And now I can go home and say. <laughs> Speaking and of which. <laughs> my mother. She'd yes. be very glad that I had a haircut. Yesterday. Yeah, mm -hmm. you're looking pretty dapper if I do say so myself. Thank you. Thank you. Um, but speaking of uh, Espanol, mm -hmm. you're going to talk to me about the Jota Nueve. We. Oui. Oh. <laughs> Why? We oh. were so close. <laughs> so this is the Jura J9. This is the Jura J9. It's very pretty. It is. It's um, a very smart machine and okay. a very sexy machine. I like both. Mm -hmm. It's a good combination. Mm -hmm. Why don't you take me through its situation? All right. Well, I'm going to ignore the... Uh, right up front for a minute and just talk about the, the basics candy. yep okay. this is where um you should put beans if you want. you know if you want coffee that's <laughs> yeah. the that's like the minimal in input. there or something yeah um yeah <laughs> okay three three beans that's <laughs> what we've have done. at least three um, at all times so it holds about a half pound 8.8 okay. ounces so oh. if you're an illy fan a whole can of illy okay i don't know why i have those things committed to memory i don't know I either phone a disturbing water reservoir mm -hmm. 71 ounces Oh, water filter. Guess yes. what? Use their water filter. Never get your hands dirty descaling. Um, was that an extreme um, close-up? Yeah, it was. Uh, okay. <laughs> I'm super up in your grill. Everybody just clicked <laughs> to another video. <laughs> All right. Uh, you got a little storage compartment here for your water dispenser in case okay. you want to dispense hot water that doesn't splash a little bit, which mm -hmm. is prone to do. Your uh, scoop for your grinder bypass. Okay. Um, and your coarseness adjuster adjustment. Uh, doer. Right. Okay. And where's my pie So pass? let's just go ahead and stick to Spanish then, shall we? <laughs> exactly. English is not my strong suit today. <laughs> this is your grinder bypass. Mm -hmm. You can dose up to two uh, shots at a time or two cups of coffee at a time. Okay. Um, and it will tell you, as it's about to do, that you we... didn't put enough in if you didn't put enough in. Got it. Okay. It... See, and now it's like, mm, you suck. Mm -hmm. um, and I also use this for cleaning, right? That is also where you put your cleaning capsule to okay. clean your brew chamber. Got it. Cool. Yes, you've got <coughs> synced up adjustable heads. Mm -hmm. You've got the butterfly action here, which like is nice. That. So you can do two cups at a time. Mm -hmm. um, and this is your drugs box. Yummy. Mm -hmm. Right? Okay. Look, drugs happen, okay? It's <laughs> one of those things. <laughs> this is not fit correctly. Right. This is what happens in Hollywood, people. Is it? There we go. Um, and then we've got this. Yeah. I love the, it's kind of a magnetic-y kind of a. Well, it's um, it's stainless steel. There yeah. it goes again. Um, and it's really kind of souped up. I yeah. mean, if you're going to think of this as like a sports car of an espresso maker, mm -hmm. um, then it should have a grill like that, don't you think? I agree. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. So this is where I'm doing my just coffee only. Coffee and then only. what's this area? This is your one-touch cappuccino stop. Oh, okay. Yes. And you've got three settings here. A uh, little pro tip. This is for your cleaning. Um, oh, on the, the far filter. left? Yes. So okay. don't leave it there when you want to make milk-based drinks because it's not going to be pretty. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You've got latte. And all the way over here with the little cloud on the cup, your cappuccino. Okay. Uh, again, a useful pro tip. The further over within each of those settings you go, the hotter the milk gets. Okay. So got you it. So you have a little bit of control. It's not going to be 10 degrees, but you yeah. know, it's going to be a degree or two, which can make a difference to some people. Totally. Yeah. Um, cool. And so now, can you take me into the eye candy? Now yes. that we have a... So right up front here, you've got your buttons that correlate to your most used functions. And mm -hmm. you can double tap each of those, you know, coffee, espresso, mm -hmm. to make two coffees or two espressos at a time or do a double shot. Okay. Um, your milk-based drinks, you just do one at a time. So you don't double tap it. It's just going to be wasted energy. Okay. But then up here on your rotary dial... Oh, you, you can, can twist fancy. it. Yes, you can go all the way in and do all those mm -hmm. drinks, you know, in a more fancy way. <laughs> more fancy. It actually, gives you a little picture. So if you're like, I don't really understand what a latte macchiato is. There you go. Yes. Cool. All right. Um, and do I get in and program all of this stuff? up top is that how i enter into that yes your okay. p button is your programming okay. and you're gonna 
go into your back menu here, and this is where you can actually see the progress of your maintenance. Okay. Um, you can manually rinse and clean the systems. Mm -hmm. uh, you hit the next, and expert mode is where you would program your, your buttons. Oh, for the different coffees. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you go in here and you say, wow, espresso, I can do my water volume, mm -hmm. my coffee strength, and my temperature. Mm -hmm. um, and just to take you through that real fast, you've got what high, normal. Do you have an extra? Nope. Mm -mm. Two settings there. Push the button to save. Copy strength. You've got five settings, um, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Five settings, four just for show, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. And here you've got your coffee volume, which again, why is it every time we do this? <laughs> it's, it's in milliliters. <laughs> well, but we're, we're, I guess we're trying to give a shout out to the uh, metric people in the world, huh? We're um, calling out our own stubbornness. Totally. Yep. Okay. Um, and so I can go in and and, sketch, and uh, program each thing in there. What else is in my menu? Well, you've got just more maintenance whether or not you're stuff. using a filter. And okay. you tell the machine when you set it up if you're going to use a filter or not. Mm -hmm. If you choose to not use it, it's going to ask you how hard your water is. And you're going to use the included uh, testing strip to kind of get an idea of what, what your water's like. Okay. Tell the machine so that it can gauge how much water you use and when you need to descale. Um, aha, here we go. Units. Mm. Let's go ahead and switch that over to good old American. There, there we go. go. <laughs> American ingenuity at work yeah, there. Exactly. <laughs> uh, so now it we'll display in ounces. Okay. Um, if you ever wanted to go back and reset it to factory settings, like something was just going sideways and you mm -hmm. can figure out like where it went wrong, just restore and it will actually do that. Okay. Um, you've got an off after, which will allow you to say stay on all day or go off after an hour. Okay. Eh, we're not open that long. We're open mm -hmm. that long. Um, and then what's the ener the save energy situation? Is that just make it go kind of slow its roll a little bit? Mm -hmm. It will okay. take it down to a, a sleep mode basically. Okay. Um, although there is a zero power switch on the back, so you can actually shut it off. Completely. Mm -hmm. Okay. We don't need it going to sleep with the store on us. Mm -mm. All right, and mm, do you want to choose language or color scheme? Um, let's do language. Language, really? Okay. So English, which we failed at. Mm -hmm. So perhaps we should go. I don't know Spanish, which we're doing really well at. Is that is that like Russian down there? Let's try it. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah. See, and now <laughs> getting nice. it back is going to be the hard part. <laughs> Gail. <laughs> You you can get into dyslexia on the idioma. That'll take you. That will, but yeah. you know. Okay, <laughs> English is luckily in English, so we're saved. Thank God. Did you see the machine tell us that? I know. Um, all right, and then this is just giving you, you wanna see how new statuses. This is? Yeah, I've made oh. five drinks on this machine. Ooh. Hey, fresh out of the box. Mm -hmm. um, and this will actually be kind of nice. People People use this as a badge of honor with their machine, and it really kind of tells you the return on your investment. So cool. yeah, it's fun. All right. So now that you've taken me through it, it, the little sexy mode, let's go real sexy mode and make, make a drink. No, Yay! not just a drink. I'm going to make <gasps> you a candy drink. Oh my God. It's almost <laughs> Halloween here at Seattle Coffee Gear. So I've taken the liberty of adding a little chocolate oh, and a little coconut oh, syrup. Our friends at Monin. Okay. Yes. Mm-hmm. And we're going to make you a yummy drink. Mm, all right. All right. And I'm also, while I'm doing it, because I can multitask, mm -hmm. as long as it only involves touching a button, mm -hmm. I'm going to go ahead and program the volume on the cappuccino button. Oh, and did you just do that by pressing down on what you wanted? Yep. Push okay. and hold. Push and hold. <laughs> oh, there we go. It's giving you the business today. It is. I noticed that it was um, not quite seated in there right, so I think I'm going to have to get in there and, and just figure that out. Look at that foam, though. Yeah. That makes up for a little sass. And when I have enough foam, I'm going to push the button again, and it will remember that portion. You're not saying when, so I'm going to call good. it. That's <laughs> good. I was like, it was, it was good as soon as it started. <laughs> like, just a hint. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know, we need something to cut out that uh, the chocolate. <laughs> the yeah. chocolate and the... Um, it's going to be yeah, nice and layered, oh, yeah. too. Yeah, and it's going to switch over to your espresso portion now. And when you have enough espresso, you're just going to... Enough espresso. I can't believe I'm using those words mm. together. But when your portion is enough, you're just going to go ahead and push the button again, and it will remember. All right. 
Ready? Yes. Do you want it super luscious? Let's go. Okay, we'll just run it out a bit then. All right. You know what that should be? Do you see the little light back there, by the way? I do, a little disco light. Kind of fun, because, mm -hmm. you know, coffee is that type of drink. Yeah, what do you think? It looks good. Yeah? Are you going to try it? Prettier? Well, yes. Well, ladies first. <laughs> yeah, I made that for you, Kat. Uh, I don't know if I'm necessarily a lady, but... <laughs> I'm not saying anything. Mmm! <laughs> okay? Yes. Yeah? Yeah, I mean, to it's get the full the full rowdy effect, we'd have to do some stirring down there. Yeah, I can see a little right bit now of I'm that getting chocolate. A, right now I'm getting a hint of the flavor. Well, and sometimes a hint is enough. You don't mm -hmm. want it to take away from the coffee. I concur. Yeah. Um, all right, so anything you like or don't like about this uh, that you want to shout out? You know, uh, this is giving me a little, mm, but mm -hmm. other than that, that's just a one-time thing. The, the Jura's are really super crisp friendly so mm -hmm. i tend to like them and forgive their faults but okay. some of the things that people will talk about is mm -hmm. you know you have to you have to clean your milk system yeah you know but when you're in your programming menu you can actually program it to your lifestyle and you can okay. say you know what prompt me to rinse it after it's been idle for 10 minutes so that that I milk see. doesn't dry up in there okay um or you can say after i make a milk-based drink I'm going to leave the house, so let's get that rinse on. Got it. Um, and that's just that's just cleaning out this part. To actually get down into the tube, there mm -hmm. is a cleaning cycle that you can run it through. Um, and that will get all the milk out of the out of the tube so that it doesn't dry up in there and block your flow. And are you using um, like a some kind of a cleaner a detergent for to, to, to do that, or are you just doing water? Yeah, in your welcome kit, you actually get a cappuccino cleanser okay. and just a little tiny dose of that mm -hmm. and a frothing pitcher of hot water gets it done so it's a so you just process. you just put that the little hose in there and start it on its cycle and mm -hmm. it takes care of it for you yep and it's just a function right here in the programming menu so clean, clean the milk, the milk system. system and it takes okay. you through it step by step i mean even little pictures that say you know what now time to put let's go ahead in. and let's go ahead and put it oh, in okay oh nice <laughs> and it says put your cleaning solution in and you need 250 milliliters of water to go with 15 milliliters of cleanser and i dig it's that it's gonna start it <laughs> and there's no <laughs> yeah it it's so. gonna do milk only <laughs> cool um so that's just kind of something to think about as far as you know the um issue there, look it. It's yeah. I it's just doing it. Suddenly, reach up and turn it off. <laughs> a, a I don't know. It's move. kind of looking like it's like got grounding lights and fog. Mm -hmm. It's kind of like an '80s hairband right now. Funny. <laughs> you didn't ever think you'd say that about a Jura, but I I never did. Yeah. think I would say that. And here mm -hmm. I was thinking that's about right. landing in San Francisco. Oh, but, you know, if you want to go '80s hairband, that's fine. Yeah, sure. Why not? Number two. Cool. All right, so that is the J9 by Jura. You'll edit all this out, right? No way. <laughs> Thank you very much, Chris. Thank you, Kat.